Mary Mahoney was born in Boston, Massachusetts during the spring of 1845. Her parents were freed enslaved blacks who moved to Boston from North Carolina. Mahoney was educated at Phillips School in Boston, which became one of the first integrated schools in America after 1855. As a teenager, Mahoney began working at the New England Hospital for Women and Children, wanting to become a nurse. For 15 years, she held many roles, such as a janitor, cook, and washerwoman. Mahoney also worked as a nurse's aide, which taught her a great deal about nursing. In 1878, at 33 years old, Mahoney Mahoney gained admission to the hospital's professional graduate school for nursing. Reportedly, 42 students entered the program in 1878, but only four completed it in 1879. Mahoney was among the women who finished the program, making her the first black person in the U.S. to earn a professional nursing license. She decided against being a public nurse due to the overwhelming discrimination she faced. Instead, Mahoney pursued a career as a private nurse. Her patients were mainly from wealthy families. She was known for her efficiency, patience, and caring bedside manner.